This tutorial is going to show you how to create a Google form and then embed it in your Wiki or Moodle. So um, first off you have to log into your Google account. You can go to google.com and um, up here in the upper corner log in. Once you're logged in you'll go to documents. You can also go to docs.google.com and log in directly there. My documents are here but if you haven't used Google Docs in a while it might be underneath the more or the even more and you can do a control F and go DOC and Google Docs will pop up and I'm in my Google Documents. You'll see I have quite a few. Well I'm going to click on Create and I want a form. When I create a form I'm going to see this pop up. So my form is going to be my um, Survey on Web 2.0 Tools. And then this is a sample question already so I'm going to change this from sample question to my question. I'm going to delete this information here. I don't want a subheading. Which tool do you find most useful? Okay, and notice that this is set on text. Well, I want a multiple choice instead. And under my multiple choice, I could put a help text or subtext if I want, but instead I'm just going to use this and add my options. Each time I want a new action, option, I click here. I can make this a required question by clicking right here and I can also add other and then they can name their own. When I'm done, I click done and I have my one question. If I want to add another one, I come up here and add an item and decide what I want. Check boxes, choose from a list, a scale, a grid, or a paragraph text. I think I'll choose paragraph text. Tell me how you use this item from the above question in the classroom. And I have it on paragraph tasks, text, otherwise they would only be able to type in one line. And I can make this required if I like. And I click done. Any of these that I need to go back to, I can just hover over it and over here I will see the little edit button. I'll also see a duplicate button if I wanted to duplicate it and just change one or two things and the trash in case I want to delete it all together. You'll notice also under here themes. You can pick a different theme and if you don't want the plain theme for your form and you can click apply if you find a theme that you like. There are pages and pages of themes. Your theme is not going to show up here but it does indicate. So once you're done with creating your survey the next thing that you're going to do is you could email the form but I'm going to go to more action because then I have my embed code. So I'm going to click on embed and here's my code. It's already highlighted so all I need to do is control C for copy or right click and copy whichever way you prefer and then you're going to bring up your Moodle course or uh, um, or your wiki. I'll do both. Okay, let's pretend in my wiki I'm going to add a label or in my Moodle course I click add a label and here I need to click on HTML because that's where we paste code. And then I click update and I'm going to click save and return to course and I will see that my survey is now embedded into my Moodle course. I could have also done it in a web page so add a page and put my survey there if I didn't want it to show on the main part of my Moodle. But let's go ahead and now do this in um, in my wiki. So I'm going to go to wikispaces.com and of course you would log in and then find the wiki that you want to post this in. Once I'm done here I need to click on edit and this um, is embedded using the widget and I would say other HTML and I have to paste this in here and click save. Now the widget doesn't look like much at this point um, until I publish this. And I think I'm going to put that on a separate line and I'm going to save that and I'll scroll down and voila! my survey on Web 2.0 tools is embedded into my wiki.